say what we say that separates us from everybody else. There's also certain stories that other bloggers aren't even talking about that I may post, eyeball may post, such and such may post. That if another motherfucker get talking about that, we know you came to us and got it. Because niggas wasn't even on that wave. With that being said, bro, stop stealing my shit. Matter of fact, hold on, check this out. Now, I know I'm not the first person to send shots at Wally the Great, but I think I'm one of the ones on the biggest platforms to send shots at him. So with that being said, I say about, what was it, a month or two ago, I'm going to say July. Matter of fact, fuck it, I'll post a picture of it. Back in July, I sent shots at him at the beginning of a C murder blog, letting y'all know that he be posting fake ass shit and I was seeing what was going on with it. Not long later, you posted a video about it. Matter of fact, hold on. If you tired of getting these fake news stories from these fake ass bloggers, get this, what happens at? Turn on Savage, Lotto Savage, and probably the whole Slaughter Gang. They put up and Nipsey Hussle's hood in Crenshaw, and they shot at some crib. Welcome to Real Talk Media. Well, we don't do that dumb shit like them niggas. Let's go. Gulf Coast Epidemic 86 is the movement. Check it out. I did a video, I think about a month or two ago, about this dude, Wally, Wally the Great News or some shit like that, all right? And I seen a couple, another person commenting on it. And I, he, okay, that was you just talking about that shit. So then recently, I posted another video where I was talking about him and I basically exposed how he got some shit started or was basically getting some stuff started between Cardi B and the Bloods and them versus old girl Billy B and the Crips or how he was trying to get some shit started with Nipsey Hussle and 21 Savage. Matter of fact, I think I'm gonna post a clip of that in here too. But then I'm gonna show you what your dumb ass did. It is what it is. But anyway, that nigga Wally the Great says something about uh, it's a rapper from New York. Her name is Billy B. Don't ask me why her name Billy B and she a crip, but that's just what it is. Her name, he did a story about her robbing chicks and supposed to be fighting chicks and beefing with chicks or something. Said she robbed Cardi B, she robbed such and such. And matter of fact, I'm not going to say it's causing commotion and causing trouble for her online or within a rap community or in her neighborhood. However, matter of fact, fuck that. It has to be addressed again how serious it is, all right? And somebody that's been locked up or really from the streets, it would take them to really know. You know, there's one thing putting clickbait, clickbait and fake. News. This dude, let me tell you how serious this is. And what's probably going to happen is someone catches them and finds out how big of a situation this is. This dude puts out fake news, literally trying to stir up gang violence between very big uh organizations in the United States of America. And not only that, he crosses lines that could literally stir up racial ten uh, tension with gangs. He does that type of stuff, uh, taking a Hispanic gang and a black gang that's already had problems and putting out a fake situation that could easily get somebody killed. True enough, Wally the Great need to be exposed. But if you're going to expose him, do it on your own. Why you got to do shit when I do shit? Okay, say I'm tripping a little bit. Matter of fact, fuck that. Let's get to this. You talk about other people doing clickbait and posting fake stories and said you don't do it, but watch this. And somebody that's been locked up or really from the streets, it would take them to really know. You know, there's one thing putting clickbait, clickbait and fake news out, trying to get your views up. Okay, sometimes that's funny or whatever. You know, I don't do the shit. I don't do the shit. I don't do the shit. Then explain this right here. Explain it. How is Little Pump going to prison for life? Explain this shit. You don't do clickbait. You come on now, bro. Don't play with me. Everybody to watch my channel know that I keep it all the way a hundred. And if I'm ever wrong, I'll make a correction video and tell y'all, hey, I fucked up. But I try not to report on it unless I know I'm right. However, if I'm ever speaking to an artist, if I'm ever doing anything, y'all notice I always kept that same energy. Whether I was face to face with him, whether we was doing some little live shit or no matter what it was, I always kept that same energy. Why you can't keep that same energy with Alshon Martin when you was face to face with him on the live, but yet you keep posting these little sneak diss and ass videos? Oh, my niggas don't know what I'm talking about. Real talk mafia. Check this shit out. Let me tell you something, bro. I don't, I don't know. I don't know who you, who, who, who I don't know who, who you are. I don't, I don't know who you are. I don't know. I don't really know nothing about you. I see your little posts on YouTube and shit. You feel me? Um. You 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 always attack it, like always saying something about Treyway or whatever on your whole YouTube channel. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna tell you, bro. I don't know who you talking to or whatever. Let me tell you something, bro. I'm from Nine Deuce Hoover. Nine Deuce. I'm not from no 90, whatever the fuck you said. 
I am from nine dudes over. Side note, in some of your blogs, you be acting like you a cripper, telling niggas you a cripper, cool with the crips, and I remember you was saying you was cool with Spider Loke, you know Spider Loke. Well, I asked him myself, and that nigga said he don't know you, and if you think I'm lying, don't, man, hold on, wait a minute. Let's get back to this. Soon as that nigga got to talking about I'm from Nine Deuce Hoover, I'm from such and such, that, you supposed to be like, oh yeah, well that's cool, I'm from Coast Crib 294, X Block, okay, you not even from over there, so I'm even gonna leave that alone, but you get my point. Fuck that, you said you was a crip, you lying ass nigga, fuck out of here. Let's get back to this. You can sound from Nine Four, you can sound, you can, you can sound from all of them, because I'm all of them tatted on. I got that's why, look. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Go ahead. I got grimy snidies on my face. I got fig west on my I got most hated. I got I got nine deuce on my neck. I got HIP little T bird. I got my homies all this is where I come from. Well this is where I done I've been shot five times for Hoover Street, bro. I done served time. I done fought cases. Murders, nigga. I done fought murders, nigga. You get what I'm saying? I no, been no, down no, that I road. Got, listen, 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 listen. Listen, no, let me tell you. The shit you when you speak, if you a real nigga like you say you is when you speaking up on certain situations on YouTube, make sure they facts, bro. Because you've been to prison. You been you done been to prison. You know we don't in prison and jail, we don't we ain't no false paperwork, no false allegations and speculations. That shit ain't that shit ain't jumping, bro. So you look, know, let me talk real quick. You, you out of you out of pocket for even look, I ain't gonna look, I ain't gonna bad now. You look. I hear and respect what you're saying. I ain't never called you no snitch, none of that. I ain't never dry made nothing up. Anything that I've talked about, I have talked about from some reputable source. All I'm asking you, I'm not saying that everything I said in that video was facts. But you All I'm saying is, look, I'm trying to make a new outlet. I'm trying to report on shit that other people are afraid of and want. Do you feel me on that? That's it. I'm trying to get the real ones that's still out here. I don't find murder cases on that. I'm not saying.